Hello! How's it going guys? Welcome in Milan, welcome in. How are you doing? Mass Titan, welcome in guys. How's it going? Hope you're having a good day. Message with lemon today. Nice. Uh, I did a little bit of cleanup just before stream started. Uh, about 15 minutes. Uh, replaced my like draw uh, battles which were over here. Just put them over here. Hey Miron, how's it going? Uh, and I moved my blast furnace over here. And what I did here was I, I removed one of the planks in the roof. Ow! Hey Miron, why? Hey over there. Hi, bye, going to bed. Alright, have a good night's sleep, dude. Master and with a lurk as well. Messaging three people on WhatsApp at the moment about a camp. Nice. So what I did was I removed this because I would I would like to have the solar generator inside. So that's why I have it over here. I'm thinking of putting like a piece of glass over there. Uh, I do have some glass. So I can just chuck this over here. That'll make it so that this thing should still generate. Yep, as it, as you can see. And uh, the pulverizer. <laughs> just to measure the ping delay. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, so the pulverizer, I've basically... Tr I tried to set up the input-output from the same side, but it's not working. So I set up the input from the top. Output to the front because there are no other sides are available right now and the energy is going through the back over here uh, from the solar generator just into all of these and that's basically how I've got it set up pretty simple this is the coal generator we are not using this at the moment uh, and I have myself plenty of iron uh, and we are running low on our durability on all the stuff so I'm thinking maybe should we make some new armor Uh, because like is there any point in making new armor? That's what I don't understand. Hey the one loser, how's it going? I still hate saying loser. I, I think I feel bad saying it. <laughs> I don't know why. It just feels awkward. I hope you're doing well though. Oh yeah, I also made a lunchbox. The recipe for this is pretty easy. It's just five planks and one gold. And we have plenty of gold, so I just went ahead and made that. Uh, I think the first thing I want to do is get started on smelting up our iron. And let's see, we, we have plenty of it for now. And then also one more thing I want to do is start exploring. So this, this mod pack is all about exploration, right? So I want to start exploring. We have not explored anything so far. Um, I want to see... Hey, who that? Oh, Emron. Don't be eating me in my house. So I want to explore and see if I can find myself the LA today. So you can find these at pillager outposts as well as woodland mansions. So we're going to try to find this. And I'm also... This one is going to be a side quest. And our main quest is going to be to try and find a mushroom field. So mushroom fields are pretty easy to find in this pack. Because of the nature's compass. So all we need to do is... Wait, I actually have the coordinates for warm ocean why do i have a warm ocean again uh oh yeah yeah yeah. i i do remember it was something to do with the la oh yeah you have to bring it a specific type of coral so that's why we have the warm ocean so maybe we should do the warm ocean uh travel first and then we can search for the mushroom fields i think i like that idea so let's go ahead and oh there's our first melon nice so let's go ahead and i think we have to go that way so uh we might need to make a boat red branch coral i'm not sure which one exactly it is supposed to be i think it's random isn't it all right so let's get started on our travels Oh, that's... I still have two of those uh, diamond blocks. Oh, uh, not diamond, sorry. Gold blocks. Let's get the gold blocks first. Oh, it's not random? That's nice. Hey, Makod. How's it going? We might need these fire charges, actually. I'm gonna take them. Uh, just, just in case, you know. tired can't sleep fair enough just just chill out over here till you can get some sleep 
I would love to have you. Uh, speaking of things to love. I would love getting some salmon. Because this is going to be new food. So we're going to keep one draw. Over here. And then I'm going to keep one for cooking later. Also keep an eye out on cod. If you can find some cod. That would be nice. Why is there a random slime over here? Put in the backpack? Uh, what am I putting in the backpack? Okay, so we've reached the desert. Oh, I see rabbits on the map. We might be able to get some rabbits meat. And there is a little bit of surface lava. We could have used that yesterday when trying to do the whole um, obsidian for the nether portal thing. We could have used that. Oh well. <laughs> no use crying over spilled milk or spilled lava. Is that a baby rabbit? I don't want to harm the babies. The adults though. Oh, there we go. There's the coral reef. Okay, we got the rabbit hide, but we didn't get the meat. Hmm. That is no good. There we go. Got one. I need one more. Just one more. So one is going to be for the raw and one is going to be for the cooked. Okay, so I'm going to put this away. Um, I think I'll keep this for now. Okay, that's a baby. Don't want the babies. There we go. So this one is going to be cooked. And the other one will go in our back uh, in our lunchbox. So hopefully we should start getting a little bit more health. Oh, now just just out of curiosity, chat. I don't think you can mine these corals without silk touch. Am I right? I'm pretty sure you need silk touch for this. Or uh, does shears work? Also, where are my shears? I could have... Oh, there they are. Okay, shears do not work. So, it looks like... Okay, at least we have the coral reef nearby. So, what I'm going to do is just add a waypoint over here. Say, coral reef. Okay? So, we know to come back over here. And let's start looking for the mushroom fields. I'm guessing we might need to do a little bit of uh, villager trading today. See if we can get ourselves a silk touch book. Or maybe we could do enchanting. Those, those are the two options we have. What do you think is more likely to give us silk touch? A villager or an enchantment table? Villager? Okay. You're done with messaging for now? Alright, best of luck with that. Oops. Enchant level 30? Uh, see, the problem here is that I'm not even at level 30. And to be able to get there is going to take me an XP farm of some sort. And I don't think I know how to make an XP farm in this pack. I would need to get into spirit for the soul shards. Villages also have the bonus of things like mending. That is true. We might need to get some mending because our armor is in an abysmal state right now. Oh, cycle trade is in here. Oh, that makes things a little bit easier. Then I guess we have to go with the villagers. If cycling is possible. Put a message asking if you want to help with the camp again. Uh, for that needed to message someone else from him. It's easy to message two, message two other people. Yeah, I've, I've been through stuff like that. 
It's just a messaging a rabbit hole. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything in here. Is there supposed to be like a chest or something over here? And by the way, I do have underwater breathing because of our squid backpack. The sandstone. Aha! Okay, I right clicked that and nothing's happening. Did you see that? I right clicked it. I'm not picking this up, so something's gone wrong. Did I, did I break the game? I think I broke the game chat. Oh, never mind. Oh my god, that was a big lag spike. That gave us a buried treasure map. Uh, oh, that does not look like a buried treasure map at all. That just looks like a normal map. So something bugged out over here because that's supposed to be a treasure map. But it didn't generate correctly. So I'm gonna say that I got scammed over there chat. I definitely did get scammed over there. Oh hey buddy. Okay I will say uh, getting into the backpack, the squid backpack was a brilliant idea. I, I think it was a really good idea. No ask for a refund. No refunds accepted by Minecraft, unfortunately. Moyang doesn't take refunds. Okay, let's just continue on our travels. We have 4,000 blocks to go. It's gonna be a wild ride. This coral reef, by the way, is absolutely massive. Look at this. It just keeps on going. It just keeps on spreading. I love it. You know, I wish there was more types of coral. Lemon will stream soon? Dude, that's awesome. Is there any way to pick up a villager? Um, I'm not sure. Is there any like spirit gem or something? There's a pedestal. There's a soul pedestal, but I don't think there's a way to pick him, pick up a villager. There's no mob imprisonment tool or anything like that. Is there a lasso? Nope, no lasso. I don't think Kaib is in the pack. That's unfortunate. So we might have to just do this the old fashioned way. You know, lure the villager somehow onto a track with a minecart and just push them where we can. There's no easy villagers, right? Because this is a fabric pack. Breed two villagers. Yeah, I could do that. We have two villagers pretty close to home. Because we do live in a village. So we could do that. Also, is this another coral reef? Look at this. That's one reef. That's the second one. And there's a third one. <laughs> Why is this ocean completely filled with coral? I was saying earlier though, I wish that there was more types of coral than just like the four that they added. Uh, they've added what? Pink, magenta, blue and yellow? There should have been like more types of coral. Like green. Oh wait, there's red as well. It should have been like green and lime and cyan. Like all the shades basically. Brown. I don't think black coral would have worked though. Or maybe it would. Who knows. What is this tower? Oh, this is a monument thingy. Also, why is there name tags down here? 
Apparently this is a quest. The pyramid in this what in what in the what? Oh my god, I just got mining fatigue. Mas, thank you for feeding me. Okay, so what is this? I, I, I definitely saw something over there. What in the... Okay, so this gives me mining fatigue 3 for 30 seconds. So I, I guess I'm not supposed to be digging over here. You know what this reminds me of? Uh, this reminds me of the pyramids from the Atom mod. The Atom Dimension. Or is it Atom? Atom? One of, one of those words. It reminds me of that. And you can't even dig those un until you finish the challenge inside the boss. So that's what that reminds me of. I should probably mark this. Uh, Mega Pyramid. It's a Young's Pyramid. Makes sense. There's a lot of Young structures in this pack, I believe. We have the Young's uh, Better Stronghold as well. And a few mineshafts and dungeons. So, definitely makes sense. <clears throat> I love the Young's mineshafts. They feel extremely well made. The stronghold on the other hand, I have a few misgivings about. I'm not a big fan of the stronghold. I feel that it's a little bit too same samey for the for the most part. There's like way too many of the rooms that are exactly the same. Subby's dungeon loot, yep. Hacks limiter, I like to call him. Hex Limiter from Hexalade, Hextralia. Yeah, Hex Limiter. Alright, so we definitely have to go a long way. I think I'm gonna take the water route because... Uh, that's going to be easier than uh, running across the land. As long as we can find a river path, we should be fine. We just need to find the mushroom island. Honestly, I should live on a mushroom island. <laughs> I remember back when I did E6E, I lived on a mushroom field. And I converted all the mycelium to grass. It looked really awesome. Only problem was I was really bad at building at the time, as if I'm like a master now, but uh, I was even worse. And the base that I built was absolutely outrageously bad. Like, I don't have words to describe how bad it was. Ooh, is that a tower of the wild? Or is it a broken tower? It looks like a broken tower. <clears throat> Yeah, it's a broken tower. Well, rip. Rip tower. The waystone is still there. Wait, is it? If it is, oh yes. Oh yes, I will take that. I will take that. That is a massive find. That's an absolutely massive find. Wait, can you do anything with the map? No, you cannot. Just wanted to make sure. Alright, <coughs> right, chat. So, this takes us to the first night survived in the wilderness. We have to survive for three nights without sleeping because we need phantom membrane. Now, there's only two ways to get phantom membrane in the pack. 
One is to fight the phantoms, of course, for which you need to stay awake for three nights. The second is to find an FTB dungeon. And the FTB dungeon has a chance of giving you phantom membrane. However, I don't know if I'm going to be able to find it. So we're gonna go for the first option. Alright, now speaking of options, I see an option over here to enter a skystone thingy. So let's see. Should I just go in from the top? This is going to take a while. So strap in. We should probably get the drill done today. By the end of stream today, we should probably get the drill done. Yeah, this is definitely going to take a long time. Let's hope this is the last one. If it's more than three, then it's going to be really difficult. Aha, it was three. Nice. Now, I don't really need the presses. Uh, what I do need, though, is to see if there's a flawless... Aha, there it is. So there's a flawless budding soda squads over here, which means that we can use that to get soda squads. Now the only problem with that is Oh, there's two flawless. Perfect. That actually is is awesome. Uh the only problem is there's no way for us to move this. So what I'm going to do is just mark it on the map. Flawless budding quartz. Okay? So when we get silk touch, or no, sorry, not silk touch. When we get spatial IO, we will come back and move these. Now I do want to get that. So let's do this. And I want to get eight of the sky stone and we can make a tank out of that. Which will be much better than the tank that we spent so much time making yesterday. So let's go ahead and get some more sky stone. I probably should have made a diamond pickaxe till now by now. But I think for this pack, I'm going to try and avoid the diamond tools and armor. And try to go for something else. Because industrial revolution might just be the best, like, way to go in this pack. Okay, so that's six. Check the durability. Wait, for what? What durability do I need to check? All the tools. I think uh, I think we're good. We might need to change a shovel pretty soon, but apart from that, we should be okay. All right, so that should be eight sky stone. Don't need any more. I'm just going to start chucking stuff into my bag now. So that can go, that can go. I'm going to keep the presses as a backup. Yeah, that should be enough. Uh, is there any quest in the Mesa? Let's, uh, let's look. So there's a burning geo. There's an igloo, a mushroom island, bad omen. Uh, find a goat, summoning arena. Converse with an LA. Get the wither eye. Deep Dark, Piglin Beast, Mechanical Crafters, Ocean Monument, Frog in a Cage, FTB Dungeon, Cartographer, and Pyramid. Okay, nothing in the Mesa, as far as I can see. And plus we have it unlocked on the map now, so... If we need to come back to the Mesa, we know exactly where it is. It's just to the east, pretty much. So let's continue. Uh, what is this? Is this an over... Is this a mineshaft? I think this is a mineshaft. Yeah, this is one of those exposed mineshafts that you can find on the Mesa. I don't think I care about that too much. So I'm just gonna continue finding the... 
mushroom fields. Expose mine shaft. Yeah, I had a feeling. Dude, these iguanas scare me. I, th I never know if they're gonna attack me or not. Why is there trees in the mesa? Since when is that a thing? Is this because there's a lush cave underneath? When you play your walls, you spawn at a mesa in the exposed mineshaft? Ah, no wonder you knew. Yeah, look at that. Rooted dirt means that there's uh, lush caves underneath. I don't care about those at the moment. But it's good to know that there is some lush caves nearby. We can get a lot of clay from there. And also uh, drip leaves if we need them. And the glow berries. And I think that's about the extent of my knowledge of the caves and cliffs update. <laughs> Pretty much. I know nothing more about the, the update than that. But there's a mineshaft in here. But I don't see a reason to enter it. It's a, it's a really weirdly generated mineshaft. I don't think we're gonna go explore it. Does it make any sense? I think I just ate the beef. Yeah, the one beef that I had in there, I just ate it. Bad backpack? Wait, what does the bad backpack do again? Does it give you night vision? Yeah, it does. I might need to make that. Oh, that was a rabbit. <laughs> Look at this. There's another coral reef. Like this ocean is just completely full of coral reefs. There's one right there, one there, one here, one here. This is the fifth one. What's what's going on? Why is there so many reefs? Hey, Solarius. Falling asleep yet with your leisure pack? Uh, we're just out uh, exploring today. Uh, this is the Sky Village. If you look up there, it's a sky village. So we're trying to find a mushroom field today. Yeah, we can't go up there until we get a crude elytra. And I don't even think we can go up there after we get the crude elytra. Because that thing means that we can, uh, we can glide, but we can't uh, use our rockets. Oh, I see a dolphin. Come on, Dolphin, give me Dolphin's Grace. Okay, I think it did, but I'm still pretty slow. Almost out of it. <laughs> you party there all the time. <laughs> nice. I think we have unlimited dolphin's grace. While we're in the water. That's interesting. And I found a village. Hermit! How's it going? Are you still working? How's my day? My day was pretty good. Yo, you just finished work. Nice. I hope your work day was good. It was perfect. We're just out exploring today. Uh, I don't know why I need a dead bush. Oops. Yeah, we're trying to find a uh, mushroom field. Apparently, there's a fungus that we need to talk to. Oh, glowstone. I, I actually need glowstone. That's good. Okay, I'll take everything. Yeah, there's a fungus that you can apparently talk to in the mushroom fields. Okay, this was a scam. <laughs> they just made me climb a ladder for no reason.
Okay, that has to be one of the smallest villages I've ever seen. Ooh. New, new helmet? I'll take it. He's not gonna notice. And also an apple. That's good. Uh, we can put the apple over here. You have to do some data capturing from Netflix before it switches off. No problem, Hermit. Enjoy your data capturing. I hope it goes well. Okay, let's continue. That village was a disappointment for the most part. Only thing we got, uh, only good things that we got were some food and an iron helmet and a sword. Also, why did my sword not get replaced? Hang on. It's necessary for your FOMO and bad memory. Our waystone is over here. But why do I not have my sword? I definitely picked up a new sword over there. Oh, Emron, the E doesn't work when I'm in a boat. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, my butt gets stuck to the to the boat. You have many unfinished things and you want to make the list. Oh, did Hubs cancel the Netflix subscription? I I I canceled my Netflix a long time ago. Not a big fan of the new shows. I, also, I wasn't watching it. Because I had a full work day and then I was streaming full time that uh, back when I was on the bench. So I just didn't have enough time to watch any shows. So it's like, why am I giving Netflix my money if uh, I'm not consuming any of the content? So, <laughs> just cancel the subscription. And look at that chat. Another Coral Reef. Did they tweak the world generation for the Coral Reefs? But I swear we, we've come across like seven of them so far. You badly want to cancel Netflix, but the wife uses it. Yeah. Good thing I don't have a wife then. <laughs> Single for life. Sag? Why are you Sag? When you don't have a partner, you have a full wallet of money. Life is worth celebrating. <laughs> See, Mako knows how I feel. <laughs> Being single is better than being with someone who is unkind or not compatible. Yeah, that's true. Hermit's um, spitting facts right now. And eventually there will be someone. I mean, that's what I tell myself before I cry myself to bed. Eventually someone will love me. Glucose Guardians? <laughs> Wait, what? What's Glucose Guardians? Found... <laughs> what? Found Nemo? <laughs> the, the, the... Advancements are silly. I don't understand them. Yeah, of course, you still need to wash your hair and make pasta. Ooh, nice. I love pasta. Enjoy the pasta, Hermit. And we shall see you again sometime. I had a lot of fun in your stream today. I was lurking while working, as usual. But it was good to catch another stream. I don't normally get to do that anymore.
There we go. Oh, my pleasure, Hamid. Ooh, look at that. An ender pearl, a compass. This was definitely worth coming up here. Definitely worth it. I'm famous? What? How am I famous? Oh, I think we found it. Mushroom fields. Found it. It's literally 240 blocks away. <laughs> Everyone in here knows me. Yeah, that's true. I guess that's true. Look at that. <laughs> I I could hardly tell that we traveled 4,000 blocks, chat. Thanks to you guys. Just having a nice, chill conversation with you. I couldn't even tell. Okay, there's some flax seeds. We might take this. Because flax is going to give us... Uh, what is it? It's going to give us flax, which can give us string. So, definitely need that. Yeah, Asmodeus. People need to stop yelling at me to stop treating my dog like a person. It distracts him while I'm trying to teach him to drive. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dude, if you're teaching your dog to drive... <laughs> That that is uh, that is a little bit sus, <laughs> I have to say. But welcome in. <laughs> that was a good one. All right, let's see if we can find a fungus. I mean, there's a lot of fungus here, but let's see if we can find a talking fungus. I have a dog-related joke. I, th I think it's pretty good. I think it's pretty good. But I'll wait for the ad to run out before I say it. <clears throat> There's an ad in progress right now. Let's just take all the onions we can. Because uh, onions can be used in a variety of recipes. So it's a good thing to have some of these. And also I might eat them. That gets us a little bit closer to, you know, getting another heart. So that's good. Okay, is there any use of the alliums? Uh, you can use it to make tree fertilizer. Okay, so we might keep this. We might keep the stuff. Yeah, nearly all my stuff is broken. It's not easy being an adventurer, unfortunately. And especially when I only have iron armor. I need to upgrade to diamond, but I'm not finding a lot of diamonds underground. That's the problem. It is a big problem. Also, why are there so many mobs over here? Is it because I'm on a mushroom field and they can't spawn here, so everything's spawning in a cave nearby? That might actually be it. So everything's spawning over here because you can't spawn on the mushroom fields. <laughs> that is cool. I like that. Now, how do you get a fungus? I need to know this. Uh, fungus mobs spawn naturally in mushroom field biomes. Right click one to talk with them. I don't see any on the map. Coming to a cave near you. Alright, so the dog, the, the dog joke that I have is I can't really take my dog to the park nearby anymore because the ducks over there attack him. I guess that's what I get for, I guess that's what I get for buying a purebred dog. I thought that was a pretty good one. Because ducks eat bread. That's, that's the pun. <laughs> Okay, I definitely don't see any fungus over here. 
do not explain the joke. I mean, there's some people who might not get it. Yeah, you never know, like... People who are not aware of ducks. I must mansplain all the things. Yeah, all the people don't get it. What? Why is that a fail? I think that was a brilliant pun. Alright, let's dig down and see if we can find one in the caves. Because that's literally the only thing left to do. I don't see- oh my god, I don't have a shovel. <laughs> I can't really dig down without a shovel. Okay, there's no fail for that one. Yeah, I'm gonna place the waystone. So, I'm gonna do the sandy waystone. Oh! <laughs> hey, Joe. You just yeeted me on top of a mushroom. Right. So, that's gonna be a mushroom field. I'll also waypoint. No, I don't need to waypoint. The, the waystone is actually integrated. So we don't need to do that. Hmm. <laughs> Why is that? Oh, that's sugarcane. I thought this was grass over here. Okay, should we go back home then? Because we can come back here anytime we want now. This was a long journey. Wow. 5,061 meters. It's like 5,061 blocks away. Right, I guess it's time to get back home. That was a that was a little bit of a waste I feel <laughs> not being able to find a fungus. But hopefully by the time we get back all of our ores will be pulverized because I did force load my chunks. So anything that's in there should still be working. gonna be a long trip home all right I just want to see real quick is there a way to get home directly by traveling through water that's just what I want to check right now so there's some water over here so I could technically go like this and then maybe there's like ocean down here that I haven't explored yet so I think I'm gonna go here and as soon as I hit land I'll take a little bit of a left a left turn I'm surprised that the water from the rain doesn't fill up a boat. You'd think that traveling in this weather <laughs> would be pretty bad. Let's see. Yep, let's see. That's all I can do. I, I don't have any other methods of traveling right now. It's literally boat or swim. This rain is awesome. I hate it. I hate the rain. I hate it in the game, I hate it in real life. The worst part about rain is when it falls on the back of my neck. I hate that feeling. Does anyone else have that feeling? Like really gets you? Yeah, the chilling effect. Right. I see some cord. I need the cord. Wow, have I, how have I not eaten any of these yet? Is this like a priority based system where it is the first, the first ones first? I'm going to try that. I definitely need to eat more foods. More foods equals more hearts. So we might be getting into Farmer's Delight soon. I don't know exactly when, but soon. I do like the rowing sounds though. 
that's pretty nice. In the hot dog days of plus 30 degrees Celsius, you appreciate the rain. I mean, I, I appreciate the rain for what it does for the temperature. I just don't like being in the rain. It's uh, it's always been a like pet peeve of mine, especially because I don't like water very much. Uh, I have thalassophobia, which is a fear of large bodies of water, like when you go underwater. So I have a fear of that. And it extends to rain a little bit. I'm just drinking water one sec. <laughs> it's so ironic that I say that and I just go ahead and drink water. <sighs> but yeah, any any bodies of water that I cannot control, I'm scared of. Like, I have no problem with swimming pools. Hey Lord Jaja. But I have a problem with the sea. <clears throat> How's it going, Lord Jaja? How are you doing? Okay, so that was the village which we plundered, isn't it? So we might need to go to the left over here. And see if we can find our way directly through the water. You good? Nice, nice. Do you have any snack like tea and pakoda? In the rainy season? Uh, I've, I've drank tea and had like budgies many times. I guess you, yeah, budgie is basically pakoras. So, yeah, I have. Tastes really nice. Oh, there was a creeper over there. <laughs> we just drove by a creeper. Take sugarcane? I have some sugarcane. I do need to draw it though. Maybe I should take some. Alright, let's do it. Hey, Xworts, how's it going, dude? It's good to see you. It's been a while. Yeah, I definitely think that they changed the world generation for this. Because I've never seen this many coral reefs in one world. It feels like they've altered the generation. Okay, so there's... Uh, there's no way for me to go through here. I have to go across land. That is unfortunate. Yeah, I did say that. <laughs> and then I completely forgot. Ouch! Oh yeah, we got a new hut. Haha! -ha. The lunchbox, the lunchbox helps, and it definitely feels like it goes from top left to bottom right. Okay, that's good to know. Kill the rabbit. I don't need dude. We, we've got a rabbit. Uh, we ate the rabbit already. And we have another one. So we don't need to slaughter any more harmless rabbits. Yeah, we, we already got two of them. <coughs> and I would prefer not to kill rabbits. Any more than necessary. Okay, so that should do. Uh, and I think I'm gonna put the cord over here. Yeah. Is there anything that's left? I think that's all of it. Yeah, we've already eaten these two. They're not harmless. I mean, in the game they are. <laughs> Take out one cord. Oh yeah, you're probably right about that. Hey, 
buddy. You really thought you could creep up on me, didn't you? I heard you coming from a mile away. Alright, we should soon be up to 10 hearts. Sleep? I don't want to sleep. Uh, because if I sleep, then my timer will get reset. So I need to I need to keep the... Yeah, yeah. I need to get the phantoms. How many blocks would one mile be? Uh, you need to convert miles to meters for that. Because one block is equal to one meter. In real life. So Steve is 2 meters tall. So how many miles is 1 meter? Yeah, <laughs> just about to do it. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, Steve is very big. He's extremely strong as well. Ooh. Oh, okay. Steve is actually a bit shorter than two meters. How tall is he? I thought I thought he was two meters tall. Isn't he like exactly two two blocks tall? Or is it like one pixel lower than two? 180. Interesting. I'm learning a lot of new Minecraft lore today. <laughs> it's pretty interesting. Yay! 10 seconds of night vision. Because he can walk under trapdoors and all. But yeah, but he needs to crouch for that. Did you reduce the time for shrink? No, not yet. Not yet. I did not. Okay, I think I'm gonna go from this way. I'm still considering it. Okay, so that is a dead end. <laughs> There's no point in going from there. So I guess the best way is to go around. Or I could just climb up. Yeah, I guess I can climb up. Don't really have a lot of blocks though. When Steve crouches, he is 1.5 meters exactly. Okay, so he's pretty close to 2 meters then. Yeah, there we go. Haha. <laughs> we are on top of the world. Apparently the top of the world is filled with husks. And that gave us a potato. Nice. I'm not gonna eat that. Because... I can use the potato to grow more and then eat those and then also make baked potatoes and eat those. So, it's a good thing we got the potato. Also, I do not need this bow. But what I could do is craft them together and make a better bow. Why the spider have speed? No idea. Probably just like some random spider from a mod or something. Can't tell. Could be a champion mob. Or an infernal mob. Those things normally have... Ouch. Uh, those things normally have like extra stats and stuff. Hey, talking to that new pack. Yeah. Ouch. Little punk. <clears throat> Does anyone know what happened to Sona? 
What Sona? Yeah, I don't know what that is. I mean, I know what sonar is. I don't know what it is in context of the stream. The sword? I don't think the sword is called sonar, was it? Oh ho! We got an ender pearl. Nice. That was a good. That was a good fight. Was my sword called Sona? I don't remember. <laughs> also, why is there a random waste stone over here? Oh jeez! Oh. <laughs> Orange, welcome in. Welcome Raiders, welcome. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Deadshot. Play mod in Minecraft, we're doing a pack called FTB Legend of the Eyes. Welcome in Raiders. How was your stream Orange? What did you get up to today? Was it just more dying or was there a little bit of progress? Yeah, I'm not at home but I think I should be fine. If I start taking a lot of damage, then I'll start using my sword. You never die. <laughs> I see you've learned some sarcasm, Orange. <laughs> Chat has actually killed me close to 160 times in this pack. Or 170 times. In just three days. God, how? I had three hearts of health. How'd you kill me? What the heck? Hang on a second. Yeah, that's instant damage. That should be two hearts. How'd, how'd you kill me? That doesn't make any sense. What the heck? Dude, that's that's messed up. That's messed up, Emron. That's messed up. I don't believe it. I don't believe you. I'm I'm literally exactly 1999 meters away. And by the way, I don't think there's a slash back in this, is there? Nope, there's no slash back. So I can't go back to my to my grave instantly. Good job. Well done, chat. You viewers have killed you 800 plus times in the three weeks you're on this build. <laughs> yeah, I died like a thousand times in my not too complicated two world. Which was the one before this pack. Do you know what happened? There's ads right now. Uh, I died. Uh, chat killed me. Check your minimap. Uh, I don't have the journey map. I have the normal minimap though. What do you mean cheat C command? I think you mean convenient command. Yeah, but everything that could help you in this pack, uh, you don't have access to pretty much. There's no Ultimine. There's no Wayne Mine in the pack, Orange. That should give you a pretty good idea of how vanilla-ish this pack is. Also, there is a Tower of the Wild over here. 
Uh, but I can't actually go up there. So I'm not really used to playing without Ultimine or Vayne Mine. So it's a really like back to vanilla kind of experience for me. Because I've got I've gotten so used to having it in the packs that when I first started playing this and I didn't have it, my first thought was install it. <laughs> but then I decided that you know what? I might as well play the pack the way it's intended to be played. Hey, <laughs> Lord Jaja, eating does not work when I'm in the boat, unfortunately. I get stuck to the boat. Emiron tried that earlier <laughs> and it didn't work. Yeah, you gotta pick your moments, dude. <laughs> you gotta pick your moments. Unfortunately, no refunds available. They found this radioactive capsule on roadside in Australia the near the Jari Mine. <laughs> uh, Surrender Sis, thank you so much for the follow. You need to sleep? No problem, Orange. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Go get some sleep. And I hope you had a fantastic stream. And I hope to see you again soon. I'm probably going to be catching a lot less of you now. Because I, I go to the office every day. So I, I don't work from home anymore. So unfortunately, I can't like check into your streams in the morning and then at night I'm streaming at the same time with you are. So unfortunately, it's difficult for me to catch up with you. I want to see your manager. I am the manager. <clears throat> I am the one, the one. Oh, Mas, thank you for feeding me. That's wrong. I gotta go this way. How far away are we? 450 meters. At least our items are not gonna be spilled out all over the ground. They're gonna be in a grave, neatly packed for me. And I think we died right next to the waste zone, right? Am I correct? I believe we died right next to the waste, uh, the random waste stone that we found. So that should still be there. As soon as I go home, I'm placing that waste stone down. <laughs> it's gonna be so good to finally be able to teleport. Yep. Hey! Oh, 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 oh! Amazon! Dude! You almost got me stuck in the water. Okay, yeah, there's still some orange dugongs over here. I don't think I can reach them. Um... You gotta go? Alright. Have a good night's sleep, dude. Or if, if it's not night, have a good day. Have a good whatever time zone it is, basically. Yep, two minutes. We're just gonna be stuck like this. Wonder if I can just dig my way through this. Ooh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't appear to be a way to dig my way through this. Because there is sandstone over here. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> sandstone doesn't take too long. Can you place a block? No. Unfortunately, nope. Surprisingly, sandstone doesn't take a long time to break. Alright, can I do something like this? Nope, I guess not.
Oh, hang on. <laughs> I may have just figured out a bit of a trick. But unfortunately, I can't use it for more than one jump. Sandstone breaks like none other IRL. Is sandstone like really brittle? Is that it? <clears throat> oh, hey, orange. There's one. There's two. Three. Four. And the last one. There we go. Alright. So we got our stuff back. That's good at least. Oh, there's another one. There we go. So that's all of them, and that's 190 death. Right, let's go back home. Now to loot? No, no, no. Now we go back home. Before we die again, we go back home, we deposit all our stuff. <clears throat> and then... Then we go loot. Oh, loot the waypoint. Yeah, we got the waypoint. Can easily be, uh, break a thin piece. Oh, hey Paddy, how's it going? Welcome in. It's good to see you. I haven't caught you in a while. <laughs> what are you doing on at this time of day? This is my new stream schedule. Paddy, I stream at this time. I start like one hour before whatever the time is now. And I stream for four hours. To lose the waypoint you marked. Uh, that is over here. Yeah, because of my new uh, project at my workplace. I have to go in, go actually work at the office. I can't work from home. And I have to go in the mornings. So nine to six. So I can come back home and stream from 7.30. 7.30 11 11.30. No more morning streams for me. And unfortunately at work we have a corporate uh, like network thing. So Twitch is actually blocked on that. So I can't watch anybody else when I'm at work. Which is kind of unfortunate. But I have worked, a, uh, I have worked out a hybrid uh, schedule with the guys, with my team. So I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be working from home on Mondays and Fridays, and I'll be going to the office on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So at least on Mondays and Fridays, I'll be able to watch my people. Nice to see you at my kind of time. Yeah, I think there's a lot more people that can join in who are from Europe, uh, UK, Ireland, Scotland, Wales. France, Germany, Italy, Portugal, Spain, Estonia, Denmark, all those places. Sorry if I missed all of them. <laughs> I don't really remember all the countries. Netherlands, there we go. Yes, that is an important one because Milan is from Netherlands. I remember, I just forgot to include it in the list. How can I forget Netherlands? My, my... Football club manager is from Netherlands. Eric Ten Hag from Manchester United. He's from Netherlands. Well, why are you still mad? You should be happy. Alright, let's go loot this thing. It should be pretty easy now that we have our gear. 3.15 p.m. here, so it's going to be nice to come home from work and have you on here now. Nice! I'm glad. I'm glad I, I can be there. And this will be this will be my streaming schedule for pretty much the entire time I'm at my new job. So, hopefully for a long time to come. Kind of unfortunate that I can't watch Wiggly anymore. But maybe I can, I can still watch him on Mondays. So, Mondays and Fridays. 
That's the only time I can... I can wiggle my way. We have Wiggles, we have Quinlan, a few others who I watch. Ooh, hoo, hoo. But then again, there's a whole new, like, it was up at 5 a.m. just to see my Wiggly streams. <laughs> Dude, I appreciate that. Yeah, this, this timing is not that bad. There's a lot more Europeans that can watch. I think the Australians and the New Zealand people have a bit of a uh, problem at this time. Let's say you don't see me in your chat. Yeah, 5 a.m. is rough. It's, it's rough. Like, even waking up just at like 7.30 a.m. for me is rough. So 5 a.m., I can't even like imagine how bad that would be. Oh my god, we got four enderpearls, chat. Chat, do you know what that means? Do you know what this means? This means we can make a warp stone. And the warp stone will allow us to teleport home at any time. We have done it. We have managed to acquire the four enderpearls. <laughs> and all we needed to do was kill one enderman. Literally everyone else we just... You know, we just found all the other enderpearls. Warpstones have durability? That's fine. I did get up some morning to look at you and Wigglies here. Yeah, you've, you've definitely been there in the chat. Okay, let's go home. Uh, this one is done, so we're not going to keep that anymore. I'll have to chat with Wigglies to stream like me. I don't think he'll be able to do that, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure it's like 3 a.m. for him or something. Right now. Let me check. What is the time for the Wigglies? It's 4.13 a.m. right now. Dodge and weave. Weave and dodge. Jesus. Ouch. Stop it. Oh my god, there were so many skellies over there. Oh, we got a comfort. Uh, comfort. I don't know what that is, but I'll take it. I'm guessing that's from the rice bowl that we ate. Uh, we ate. Weep and dodge. No, no, weave and dodge. The only weeping we do is after dying. Which does happen quite a bit. <laughs> Let's be honest over here. We definitely do die a lot. Okay, I think it's time to boat. It's time to get about, and it's time to get out of here. Oh hey, another slime. Hey slimy. Sorry, I don't need any more of you right now. There we go, home sweet home chat. We have made it alive. We definitely did not die. Nobody saw that death. Okay, where is, uh, where is my pressure plate? Oh yeah, I forgot about, <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Ah, no worries, we can, we can do the whole thing another time. It's fine. We can do the phantom things later. I don't see a need to make the elytra right now. Uh... Although, one thing I do need to do is get that thing off my roof. What are you doing on my roof? Okay, that's much better.
Right, so first things first, let's clear out our backpack. Make sure that we have enough space to put all our stuff. And this goes away. Let's see, we'll put that away. There's a few things over here that I'm like, you know, not sure where to place. We'll be back in 15 minutes. All right, sounds good, dude. Okay, I will plant this potato before anything else. The potato definitely needs to be planted. And so does the flax. Look at all that cabbage. Look at that. 13 cabbage. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, uh, speaking of food, we are going to need to cook this stuff up. So, oh, we got some more cooked bacon. <laughs> I forgot that I put that to cook. So, let's put a raw cord in there. And I'm going to get my stairs because I don't really use this for anything else. So, might as well use it to cook the food. So, there's going to be one cooked cod, one cooked salmon, and one cooked rabbit. That's going to be the three foods that we cook. And I think... Uh, that's pretty much it, right? Yeah, I don't think I have a lot of place in my... In my chests. Definitely need to get... A2 as soon as possible. Uh, does pack have any RF tools? I don't think so. Because RF tools, as far as I know, is only on Forge. And this is a fabric pack. Yeah. So I believe there's no... Uh, RF tools in this pack. I don't know exactly what McJD's uh, way of thinking is when it comes to fabric versus forge. Oh my god, looking through all of this stuff is really annoying. I need to get A2 set up as soon as possible. <laughs> I'm just not having fun with the whole battles. Oh, not that. We need that. That as well. Okay, uh, so I need my lunchbox to be filled with these things. So the top three slots are going to be the three foods that we haven't eaten yet. And then the bottom slots are going to be filled with nourishing food first. And then the least nourishing food will be after that. So it's going to be like this. Carrots will go here. And I guess I can put the onions here. Okay, this, this should work. Too bad it's only 9 slots. Honestly, that, that would have been nice if we had more slots. Okay, why did you not eat the first one this time? I thought this was supposed to eat from top to bottom, left to right. Didn't we test this out just a little bit earlier? So apparently I was wrong. There's a surprise. Deadshot is wrong about something. Okay, let's just remove the main food then. Hopefully we can get the hearts from this, this stuff. Uh, and are you done? Uh, you look like you're done. Perfect. I'm gonna stick this in here. And I might need to put a little bit more coal in there. Okay, that's all the coal we have. So hopefully this, this lasts us for all the stuff. I am going to replace this a little bit. Yeah, that should do. That should give us all the ingots. Uh, speaking of ingots, 
Uh, my iron armor is pretty close to dead. <clears throat> and so is my pickaxe. I think it's going to be time for a mining trip. I'm going to take four pickaxes. And I'm going to go mining for a little bit. Okay, that should be good enough, I think. To keep us going for a while. Uh, we'll also take a few logs. I think 8 logs should be enough. And if we find some coal, we definitely need to take it. Okay, let's go. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God. Garlock. No. No. Oh my days. <laughs> Welcome in Raiders. Carlock raiding with a party of 69. Nice. <laughs> Welcome in Carlock. How's it going? Thank you so much for the raid. <laughs> it was not you. It most definitely was. <laughs> Welcome in Raiders. For those of you who do not know me, my name is Deadshot. I uh, play modded Minecraft and we're currently playing a pack called FTB Legend of the Ice. And as you can see, my house is now filled with Carlock mobs because I play with a mod called CCI. And this allows you to spawn stuff on me. So Carlock's raid has spawned in a tremendous amount of zombies. <laughs> hey Sim, how's it going? Oh god, Sim is here. Chat, Sim is here. <laughs> That's a lot of Carlock, indeed. Need to raid and run? No problem, Carlock, I completely understand. I hope you have a good time zone. Hey Mr. Vassetti, how's it going? Yeah, I'm just gonna start punching. Yep, all of them spawned inside the house, Lord Jaja. Every single one. <laughs> if they were real Carlocks, they would have nukes. Hey, Groovy Loopy Doo, get in there. Chat will judge you. Nah, I'm, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna make full use of the fact that they are stuck right now. Hey, stop that. I think I've died plenty for the first three days of my pack. I'm on 190 deaths. I have no plans to make it 200 anytime soon. Kalok hasn't slept since he started Chroma Technology too. I actually just messed up a few minutes ago. I was supposed to stay awake for three nights so that I could get the phantoms to spawn. And I slept off after the third night. So. Literally, the day before the night when I would get phantoms, I slept without thinking about it. Yeah, not my proudest moment. Ah, oh, Sim, no! Sim, I do not want it to be 200 deaths today. Please. Let me cheese the mobs. Also, how are you doing, Sim? Come on, just die already. So many car locks. Wow. <laughs> I tell you to break the carpet. I didn't even realize that it was because of the carpet that they were stuck. How, how insane is it that one pixel, <laughs> one pixel worth of carpet can stop all of these mobs? How about you? I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Hey, ow. Look at all these mobs though. So many of them. Our new sketch is going great. I'm, I'm definitely getting used to it and I did not see as big of a hit in viewers as I expected like I just thought that I'd be streaming to like five people <laughs> because like most of the people I thought that they would be uh, not able to join me but there's definitely been a lot of people who are able to join me even at this time so that's that's good to that's good to know Delta thank you for feeding me I appreciate that 
So all the like most of the people who watched me in the morning are still able to join in, which is pretty awesome. There are a few people missing, of course, but unfortunately, time zones are a thing. Ow! Starlock, stop it! Aha! I'm back to normal now. Well, <laughs> I'm gonna die. At least I can take as many of them with me as I can. Oh, by the way, I've been meaning to ask chat. Has anyone seen the uh, the Last of Us TV show? Delta, thank you for feeding me again. Saved me from certain death over there. <laughs> Lord Jaza's trying so hard <laughs> to get me killed. Here you see the dichotomy of chat. Some people who want to save the streamer at all costs and some people who want to kill the streamer at all costs. That is the dichotomy of... Oh no! Oh no! Sim! Oh Thank my... You, Sim underscore XD for gifting five community subs. Oh god. Well, there goes my... <laughs> Sim, come on. <laughs> You do not listen to me, do you? Come on. <laughs> Thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Well, there goes the there goes the challenge of not dying 200 times. That's gone out the window. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> wow. Oh, did Zidic get a sub? I just saw Zidic's name. So Zidic and Infinite Sin got the sub. Uh, Joe got the sub as well. Nice. There's some good names in there. Ow. Hey, stop it! Oh, I was just going the wrong way. Feels like I'm at a concert. Uh, time to get serious. <clears throat> I was sitting back and playing, but no more. <laughs> what concerts do you go to? Actually, no concerts. <laughs> I don't go to any concerts. How much pro progress have you made? Oh, this is this is still the same house, Sim. <laughs> I just expanded it a little bit. Why do I keep facing the wrong way? <laughs> yeah, I knocked out one of the walls over here, and I just made it like extra large. Ouch. I didn't even get to clean up the Carlocks. And there's still like five witches out there, five skellies, five zombies, and five spiders. <laughs> oh my god. I definitely need to do some sort of channel point reward that will allow people to spawn like a helper's helper mob to help me with this because this is this is a lot of zombies oh my chest plate broke <laughs> one that gives you one durability sword that would just fill up my inventory though. I mean, I guess I could use that somehow. <laughs> Worth a swing. Worth exactly one swing every single time. 
How many channel points would that be? <laughs> knockback stick. <laughs> knockback stick would be amazing. Alright, I think we got rid of most of them inside the house. Ouch. Mm. Oh my god, I just killed five of them in one in like one row. That was five five hits, five kills. Oh, that's that's the wrong one. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go back in here and uh, arrange our stuff. Chat wants you to get up and stretch. Get up and stretch. I'm having the fight of my life right now. Boy, dead shot. Chat wants you to consume age two. Oh. Alright, let's get up and stretch and drink. <clears throat> I'll consume age two first. Ah. Now let's get up and stretch. Milan, thank you for the luck. Alright, that is a good stretch. Now we fight. And we are up to 10 hearts, chat. We finally reached 10 hearts. Yes. Come on, heal up. Okay. Mast is back. Welcome back, Mast. Oh, Vino Gamer got one. Vino Gamer is also a pretty good name. Uh, Stancil Boys, this one I haven't heard before. Ouch. Do you mind not hitting me with your butt? There we go. <laughs> what happened when you were off? Uh, Sim gifted 5 subs. And Carlock raided. With a party of 69 people. Causing a lot of mayhem. <laughs> you did no such thing? I have evidence, Sim. <laughs> I literally have evidence of you gifting 5 subs. <laughs> That witch is gonna get it from me. Oh, never mind. She's gone it into the <laughs> into the portal. Fabricated? No way. Alright, so the witch and the skelly both went into the portal. Oh, this is just a normal zombie. There we go. How many poison? Ah, huh. okay. Three seconds to go. Oh, thank you for feeding me Morpheus. Misa appreciates that. Oh, there's another Zidic. Ouch! Oh my god, he <laughs> does a lot of damage. <laughs> did you see that chat? He just did seven hearts worth of damage. <laughs> Lord Jaja, chat is not listening to you today. Now that's a lot of damage. I'm probably going to need to carry some flex tape with me to fix that damage. That was way too difficult. Ouch, and I'm gonna die.
Come on, I'm gonna hit you to death with a with a lily pad. That's gonna be the most embarrassing death. All the other skellies are gonna laugh at you. And you go to skelly hell. I guess you could call it skell. Imagine dying to a lily pad. <laughs> That's going to be one of the most embarrassing deaths I've ever seen. Well, some of them have diamond armor on. So the skellies have diamond helmets. Uh, that's because the skellies are also the same ones that... Oh my god, no. Uh, the skellies are the same ones that can be spawned with bits. So because I think skellies are like 400 bits. Uh, I don't really remember right now. Good job, Deadshot. You don't remember your own CCI command. But I use the same ones for the sub. And then because zombies is 300, that's why they have the iron helmet. What? Okay, he just he just demolished me. <laughs> what was that? Give me, mm, give me my stuff back. Oh, didn't mean to use a sword. <laughs> Diamond helmets, you say? Yeah, I got absolutely slapped over there. Dude, ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, wait. What the? Hang on. I just need to check something real quick. Uh, did I change that? I'm pretty sure I had it to diamond helmets. Uh, cheers for skellies, outcomes, repeat outcome. Wait, when did I change this? <laughs> I don't remember changing this to iron. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Sim, I'm sorry. I'm 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 really sorry. I I, I thought for sure they were diamond because the sub ones are, are supposed to be the same zombies. Well, they they still do a lot of damage though. It's the the helmet is it does nothing to uh to change the amount of damage that they do to me. They do the exact same damage. Regardless of- Oh no! Oh no! Sim! Oh! Oh! 900 bits spawning the vexes! Oh my god, Sim! Well, we've, I've suddenly found myself in a vexing situation. Ah, oh my god. No, 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 no. Oh my god. <laughs> Sam, why do, you, why do you want to kill me so much? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> it's a sub stream. Apparently, Sim Sim is basically like a reincarnation of Didi. She just loves to kill me, apparently. <laughs> Death loop round two. Yeah, thankfully there's no hype train this time. Content. <laughs> do you, do, would you really call this content? Just me dying over and over and over. 200 mark death yet? I'm pretty sure we've gone beyond 200. Haha! <laughs> I'm just gonna let them stay out. <clears throat> it's the most enjoyable part of your day. Wow. Well, I'm glad my suffering brings you joy. <laughs> Stop whining. 
I'm not whining. Okay, maybe I am a little bit. Wouldn't you be though? <clears throat> Ow! Oh my god! Those vexes, man. They're brutal. Yeah, what now? Huh? What now? Oh god, there's another one. Oh god, there's more. Cha. I wonder how you kill Vexes. This is certainly a, a big problem. Oh. <laughs> Chaz is going to be... I was slain by Sim, slain by Sim, slain by Sim. <laughs> That's literally all it is. To tr try asking him then to leave nicely. Somehow I'm doubtful that would work. But these ones are not gonna despawn because they have, uh, what do you call it? Uh, they have name tags, so they're never gonna despawn. I'm gonna have to figure out a different way to kill them. I'm going to need your help, chat. You guys are going to have to feed me and heal me. Ow. Sim. You just slapped my butt over there. What was that? Shaq, welcome in. I appreciate the look. Someone needs to block Sim's credit card. Oh my god. Another 900 bits. I'm gonna just remove... Remove Vexes. <laughs> They're way too dangerous. I might move them to 1500. Because I think witches are much easier to deal with. I've never had this much of a problem before. So many of them. Sam, what have you done? No! Now there's Enderman. Great. Someone stop this woman. <laughs> Someone stop her, please. <laughs> He's destroying all the bits. Morpheus, thank you for feeding me. Hey, Taliano. We're in a bit of a pickle over here. Ah! Okay, uh, trust me, Sim. Trust me when I say it is correct. You you can trust me. I promise. I won't lie to you. You don't need to check all of them. I think I think you've you've tried them all. I don't think there's anything that's left. I'm pretty sure you've done all of them. So many Enderman noises. Why do you have so much health? Jeez, man.
Cannot stay today, just popped in to say hi. No problem, Taliono. Thank you so much for saying hi. I do appreciate the, the fact that you came in to say hi. Yeah, these guys are very loud. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, one good thing about the Endermen is that I pick when we start the fight against them. So that's good at least. Uh, uh, okay, <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Harry Potter just came in and attacked me. Okay. Uh, <laughs> he did a drive by on me. Yeah, that's the worst part about the Wexes. Is that they can attack you through walls and stuff. So it's really difficult to kill them. See? He just came out of the ground. Hey Zidik. <laughs> Welcome and thank you for the look. I appreciate it. I think that, that Enderman just double slapped me. <clears throat> oh, I do all my redeems happen to your dead body. I think you have a bit of a delay on your, on the stream. That's probably what's causing that issue. Uh, do you have FFC installed, Lord Jaja? Yeah, there was a time when Sim actually did a redeem on me like three times in a row and every single time it was on my dead body. Every single time. Oh, I think I know how to kill these guys now. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> that's, that's more like it. Oh. <sighs> Okay, we need to fight these guys. Do you not have FFZ? Yeah, I can definitely see that there's a big delay between when I'm talking and when you're responding. It's it's like a 20 second delay. Uh, I had to, sorry Emron, I had to. If I want to fight these guys, I need to fight them during the daytime. I can't fight them at night. That's just way too dangerous. I, I can do the phantom thing later. But currently getting rid of all of these mobs, that's more important. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to do deforestation on this place. Oh god, no. It's attack of the spiders. Someone heal me. Chat, I trusted you. And you failed me. You're the Alfred to my Bruce Wayne. You only have 22 points. You know, I wish I wish that Twitch would give you uh, points for every time you spend bits. That would be a nice feature, I think. What do you guys think? Like, if you spend bits, you should get channel points for that. I think that would be a good incentive, right? To earn channel points other than just subscribing. That would be so nice. Ow! It gives you multipliers? Uh, Sim, can you check your channel point multiplier and let me know what it is? <laughs> you'd be a multi- You'd be a multi-millionaire. Not just a normal millionaire. 1.2x uh, I think 1.2x is just by uh, just with the tier 1 sub though I, I think it's 1.2x for a sub 1.5x for a tier 2 and 2x for a tier 3 Okay, I got my stuff back. Oh look at that. <laughs> There's a sim in the tree Yeah, tier 3 sub gives you 2x I remember because there was one time when I wanted to get moderate, uh, not moderator, I wanted to get VIP in a channel and I subbed 
at tier 3 just to get the points. Because it was 69,420 points. Oh, is it 1.4 for tier 2? Fair enough, fair enough. I thought it was 1.5. I must have been wrong. Okay, so there's another sim over there and over there and then some mobs on this side. I'm, I'm gonna keep finding mobs the entire time I play through this pack, aren't I? Oh, dude! Oh, what the? Sim! How? How? Didn't you already have a... Oh, tier 3! Oh my god. Did you just upgrade your sub to tier 3? Oh my days. Chat, can we get some love in the love in the chat for, for Sim? Sim is, I believe, my second tier 3 subscriber. I don't believe it. Sim, thank you so much for the tier 3 sub. I don't even have anything set up for tier 3 subs because I don't think that's possible with stream elements. I, I need to set up stream labs for this. Oh, there you go. There's another. <laughs> there's another diamond helmet skelly. Yes, yes. Sim, fight Sim. I'll help. I'll help the spider Sim. No. Oh. Oh. Okay. You <laughs> got there in the end. Somehow. Somehow you made it. Yeah, we just have a battle of the sims over here. Where is the witch? I hear you. Where are you? Oh! <laughs> Did, why is there a witch in the tree? What are you doing up there? I think she's confused, Chad. <laughs> she doesn't appear to understand what she's what she's doing. <laughs> why, why is she on top of the tree? <laughs> That's a ninja witch, yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Get down here. <laughs> How am I supposed to get her down from there? Uh, I don't think I have a way to do that. <laughs> Ah, there you go. Oh, okay. That, that was the funniest thing I've seen in a while. And now there's a skelly stuck in a tree as well. Okay, this mangrove biome is not the best biome to live in, that's for sure. I'm gonna be ambushed by all of these, like, hiding mobs. They're gonna be hiding in the trees and waiting for the opportune moment to kill me. I need to move to a plains biome, where I can see everything. What do you guys say? Do you guys reckon we should move house? It's really difficult to find the mobs over here. Ah, let's eat. <clears throat> Mesa would be a good one as well. And we do have a... Um, we have a mushroom field as well. <laughs> if I don't, you likely force me. I mean, that's true. Uh, it's um, I'm getting cl pretty close to that. All right now, there's a there's a vex somewhere over here. Worry about more about chat than mobs in the biome. <laughs> Ow! There you are. I see you. Uh, 
Oh, oh, I see you. <laughs> There's no use trying to hide from me. I can see your name tag. Come on, come on out. He's just, Sim is just playing hide and seek with me at this point. <clears throat> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, come on. <laughs> I was so close to getting her. <coughs> I was so close over there. Yeah, this is definitely uh, like difficult to navigate the the biome. It's definitely difficult. Uh, is that is that Murak or is it Mjorak? I'm not sure, but thank you so much for the follow, dude. <laughs> the Vex is extremely indecisive, that's true. Okay, but the Vex is now gone, and that means... I think, except for this one over here, we've basically gotten rid of all the mobs. Yeah, I think so. Let's get some guesses in chat, guys. How many, how many deaths do you guys think that is? Yeah, we'll take a look at that after getting some guesses in. And I still need to kill that one Vex. So maybe we should wait till we get that Vex. Joe says 33, Mars says 55. Delta says about 40. Uh, where is that Vex? <laughs> Lord Jaja with more than 100. Mr. Vassetti says 22. There's a there's a big variety of numbers in here. Okay, why is that Vex so high up? Uh, <laughs> did, did he forget that he's he's a hostile mob? Vex! I'm gonna need you to to come down here. Aha! I see you. No, 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 no. Someone heal me. Oh, what an MLG bucket that was. <laughs> I nearly died over there. You're still getting 1.2x? Uh, I think you need to refresh. Because I definitely remember getting two X channel points for tier three. That's the way. That's that's the way I got VIP in a chat. I I hundred percent assure you that's not a scam. Oh, it might take a little bit of time to ref, uh, to like update on on Twitch's site. Ow! But I promise it's not a scam. You can you can Google it if you want. I would not scam someone like that. Ow. Come on. Down, down you come. You will spawn a whole village's worth of vex? No, 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 no. No, I, I, th that is definitely not a scam. No, do not, do not do that. Please. I beg of you. I'm ha I have my hands full to with just these few vexes that you've spawned. Ah, oh, come on! Come down here! There we go. Phew. <laughs> oh my god, that was that was insane. There were so many vexes. Right, let me just check on my side once again. Uh, how to get more? Ch how to earn? Yeah, see, it says to me tier three sub is a two x multiplier. Tier one sub. Oh, I I guess I know why. 
Uh, Sim, I think the way it works is it's going to still give you the 1.2x channel points until your tier 1 sub gets refreshed on their side. So even though it's tier 3 right now, it's probably not refreshed for them. So once that is refreshed, then probably it will update to 2x multiplier. Now that should happen pretty soon though. It should happen pretty soon. It doesn't take too long. Right, chat. This says this was a long diversion. We need to get back to work. Also, uh, is there a way for me to upgrade my barrel uh, without having to break it? Does not look like I can. Okay. So here's what we're going to do, chat. Uh, we're going to make another barrel. Uh, so I think I had, yeah, I have some acacia slabs over here. So let's go ahead and make... Uh, newbie PNG, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome in, how are you doing today? So, let's get one more barrel. Just one. And then we can turn this into the copper one. And then turn that into the iron one. What the? Oh, Sim. Thank you, Sim underscore XD for gifting Noob the subscription. Yeah. <laughs> I just stopped dying. I didn't even finish my count yet. <laughs> hey, newbie, welcome in. You just got gifted a sub by... Sim, oh, it was your, it's your boyfriend. Oh, <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Hey, Margaret, how's it going? Welcome in. <clears throat> As you can see, I'm not having the best time of my life. Ouch. Oh. oh, there we go. I think we got the zombie. Come on. Come on, Skelly. You're next. Ah, oh, come on. Almost had him. Yeah, there we go. Now you need you need the sword. Okay, and that's the spider. Honestly, if I ever get up from my bed and see a spider that big in the ceiling, uh, I would just die. <laughs> I would not wait. I would not do anything. I would just die straight up in my bed. <laughs> if I ever see a spider that big, I'm just going to, I'm going to get promoted to heaven. Okay, so that's an iron barrel. Let's go ahead and get a gold one as well. I don't think we can get a diamond one, unfortunately. But this should be pretty good for now. Uh, let's put all our stuff in here. Except the acacia logs. We need those. Uh, and I'm going to put this stuff over here. Just so that I have a bit of a better inventory. Then we can do this. Uh, Texas is frozen. Uh, you're cold and trapped at home. Going to enjoy another day of Minecraft. You know what? That sounds like the best way to enjoy a cold and frozen day. When you're a spider that big in your room, just go to sleep. They are passive during the daytime. <laughs> I don't exactly think Minecraft mechanics would work like that in real life. Oh, I need to get some more copper. I need to cop some more copper. I don't think I have enough gold to do. Oh wait, I do. But should I actually be using all my gold? I have 44 gold. I would be using, what, 8, 16? Yeah, I think I can do that. I can spare this much. So three gold barrels should be good for now. Uh, and I'm just thinking, I'm gonna break this. 
And I'm going to start chucking the stuff in here first. Okay, maybe these two blocks of gold can be converted into ingots as well. So they take up a little bit less space. And then I'm going to break this one as well. And then the third gold barrel will go here. Yeah, I think that's good. That's good. So that's a little bit extra space. So that we don't really have to do so much inventory management all the time. There's still going to be a little bit of duplication of items. Uh, unfortunately, I cannot manage that without, you know, having some sort of priority system and setting up an auto uh, automatic item input. So for now, this is how we're going to deal with our storage <laughs> by just expanding it. And I think it's time for us to get another set of armor because Sim has completely destroyed the armor that we have. So let's get another set. So that's, uh, I think it was 24, right? So let's get a chest plate first. Then we need a leggings. Need, I mean, I think I might as well make a new helmet. Because the one we have is about to die. So I'll put this one on and when it dies, then we can switch out for this one. So, shield on. And let's go mining. And also, let's make a shovel. Because we will run into, uh, what do you call that thing? Gravel. While we are mining. So I will need a shovel for that. Speaking of shovels. Where's my sticks? Did I run out of sticks? Looks like I did. Okay. Oop. <sighs> Alright, chat. Do you reckon this much is enough to get started? Maybe we should make a little bit more... A few more torches. And this time, uh... Our main goal is going to be just getting as many diamonds as possible. I'm going to go straight down to Y-59. No dilly-dallying. Drill? Are we there yet with the drill? Like, can we make this? We're going to need a little bit of silver for the drill. I don't think we have silver. <clears throat> so I guess we are going to need some tin, silver and diamond. That'll be the stuff that we look out for. Okay. Uh, now, th now the thing is, I started going the cave route. Instead of that, I'm gonna start digging straight down. Uh, when I say straight down, I don't mean like straight straight. I mean relatively straight. Something like this. Okay, at least our tools get replaced. And my lunchbox is empty. Okay, good thing I caught this before I went down too far. Let's go fill up our lunchbox with some stuff. Uh, I wonder if the potato that I planted has grown up yet. <clears throat> sure thing. Consume H2O. Check for silver. I should have a little bit. But I didn't mind too much. I didn't mind too much. Because I was more focused on mining like uh, iron and stuff. Alright, I just want to check real quick. Uh, did I get the potato yet? I did. It, oh, and it gave me two. Perfect. So we're going to eat one. And then the other one we're going to bake, uh, because baked potatoes. Are a different food source. <clears throat> I really need to start, uh, start finishing my sentences. Uh, oh yeah, we also have to check how many deaths. We should check how many deaths we have. Okay, so there we go. Let's take a look. There's definitely more than 
67. It's definitely more than 67. It was 190. So let's check the statistics. Number of deaths is 266. 266. So is that 76 deaths? Wow. <laughs> that is a lot of deaths. 76. Feel like it should have been more? No. <laughs> 76 is really bad. Oh my god, dead bot. Dead bot. Shh. No. That's that's the worst time. Literally. <laughs> Sim oh my god, dead bot just wants to kill me. You hush. You hush, you bot. No, 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 no. Dead bot is mean. Okay, we have 15 silver ingots. Maybe we can make the drill. Actually, uh, maybe we can make the drill. So let's go ahead and make the stone drill. So that's what? One, two, three, four, five, six. But I have so many pickaxes. Is ravagers attempting? Don't, please. Please don't. I, I can only beg of you. There's nothing else I can do. Save them for for another day. When I'm when I'm getting ravaged by other mobs, then you can set the ravagers on me. If you want. Okay, so we've got the iron drill head. Uh now I could technically make the diamond head as well. Unfortunately, the diamond head needs a lot more stuff for making it work inside the mining drill. So I'm not going to put the drill head up to diamond just yet. We can upgrade it in the future. <clears throat> oh, we have LF. LF is not a problem. We have the solar generator, so that can we can make LF from a lapis lazuli flux container. Now, I think I'm going to need 8 silver for this. 8 silver plates. And we're going to need some nickelite ingots. So let's see how many we need. We need 4 and 2, 6 nickelite ingots. And 8 silver plates. So 6 nickelite is literally 6 of these. So let's make 8. And I think that goes in the infuser, right? Pretty sure it's in the infuser. Yes. And then the compressor is going to make 8 silver plates. Okay. I think the solar generator is keeping up. <laughs> it's so slow. Yeah, it is pretty slow. Uh, and then the Mark 1 circuits is going to need four of these. Uh, oh, what? What's happening? What's happening, Sim? Can you please... Oh, Sim, no. <laughs> please, no. <laughs> oh my god, this, this is cyberbullying at this point. <laughs> Hey, stay guys. Oh my god. <laughs> Sim with the 2000 bits. Oh my days. Sim, why? I literally just said wait. Why would you do that? Not bullying? What do you mean to start bullying? Morpheus, thank you so much for the heal, but honestly, I would not waste it right now. Oh my god! They're pulling up my crops. You just let me have them outside? Yeah, I guess that makes sense. <clears throat> That's fair enough. That's fair. 2,000 bits, jeez. How many bits is that? How many bits have you done today? Someone needs to block your credit card. Newbie, can you can you take Sim's credit card out of her hands, please? Yeah. <laughs> Just, 
They can't, they don't even have to get inside the house to hit me. See? <laughs> I die even though I'm standing in here. Uh, what? I can't even get to my items. Aha! Oh, ouch. Okay, I thought I got them, but they got me instead. Ouch. I think I lost... I think I lost my helmet. Allow you to use a weapon? <laughs> I mean, I don't see what... The point because i'm still gonna die multiple times but if you're allowing me then i should try to get my sword back Ouch, come on yeah see that's the point that's the thing like what's the point all right so let's just do this the old-fashioned way with our fisticuffs because I'm, I'm not going to be... They're gatekeeping my iron sword at this point. So, mm. I guess the, the blame is on me for actually giving this option to people. <laughs> I can hardly complain, can I? Oh, dude! Dark... Oh, dark, dark helmet. Oh, no. Don't be getting any ideas now, chat. Dark Helmet, thank you so much for the 500 bits. Awesome, with another 100. <clears throat> and another 100. And another 100. How much is that? Was that 400 bits in forms of 100? Run away! Uh, that... <laughs> Time for a new base, pretty much. Oh, stay away from me. Ah, oh, there's so many of them, Chad. There's so many of them. What am I supposed to do? Like, are you guys ever going to let me progress in this pack? <laughs> or are we just gonna keep playing Dead Shot Death Simulator? Dark Helmet, how are you doing, by the way? It's good to see you again. Ouch. No. Oh. New pack. <laughs> New pack. They, they spawn inside my house, Sim. They spawned in my safe, in my safe space. Oh, dude! Oh, dark helmet. Seven hundred bits. What is going on today? Why are you guys so, so after my blood? 